السلام علیکم ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس آف کلاس نائنتھ ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس ٹوڈے یو ول ڈسکس سم امپارٹنٹ فیکٹس ریگارڈنگ دا میوزو فائٹس سو ڈیئر اسٹوڈنٹس ایز وی نو دیٹ دا پلانٹس آر اڈاپٹیڈ ٹو دیئر انوائرمنٹ ایز پر دیئر ہیبیٹیٹ on the basis of the habitat the plants are classified into xerophytes mesophytes and hydrophytes so xerophytes we discussed in the previous video xerophytes are the plants which are present you know which are grown in the desert area like cactus plant similarly today we will discuss about the mesophytes so for the mesophytes are uh, concerned these plants grow where water is neither in excess nor deficient such as cultivated land so mesophytes are those plants which grow in such places where there is neither more water nor less water but the water quantity of water is sufficient for the cultivation of plants so these mesophytes are found in the cultivated land the soil of these lands is neither very wet nor dry so the soil where the mesophytes grow it is neither very wet nor very dry mesophytes show well developed roots with hairs so the root system of mesophytes they have well developed root system the stems are solid and freely branched the leaves are generally broad thin and very shaped they have numerous stomata for example people mango rose sunflower maize tomato wheat so these are the cereal the cereal plants the pulses plants different uh, mango and these fruits and vegetable plants are categorized into the category of mesophytes their stomata have their leaves have the stomata for the transpiration process and they have a large broad uh, leaves for the photosynthetic processes and these mesophytes have developed well roots with root hairs so that they can absorb water from the soil so the main examples of the mesophytes are the rose plant sunflower plant mango people maize tomato and wheat so dear students the mesophytes are the main source of food on the surface of earth because it involves all types of vegetable plants it involves all types of fruit plants so the mesophytes are the main source of food on earth another category is hydrophytes which we discuss in later 